Thanks for joining us. I'm Heidi Alaga. A $25 million grant is coming to Tucson to pay for repairs to the 22nd Street Bridge. Right now, the bridge won't support vehicles over 30,000 pounds. That's led to school buses, fire trucks, and even larger haulers detouring through residential areas. Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg says Tucson earned the grant because its plan will benefit the economy and communities in the area. Another thing that's compelling here is the state of the existing infrastructure. Again, when you have a bridge so compromised that larger vehicles can't even use it, uh, that is creating ripple effects throughout the transportation system here, which means there's an outsized benefit to doing something about it. Money from the city plus federal funds and RTA makes the bridge project possible. It's actually been in the works for at least 17 years now. That new bridge should open in about three years. Monsoon will remain active to finish the week as plenty of moisture stays over southern Arizona to produce more thunderstorms. This weekend, a weak disturbance will pass over northern Mexico and bring an even better chance of rain to the region. Some thunderstorms will produce heavy rain and flooding will be a concern. Temperatures will stay close to seasonal averages with highs in the upper 90s and overnight lows in the 70s. This trend will carry into the middle of next week.